Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Um, today, I'm out in the bay. I uh, haven't been out for so long, so I'm pretty excited. And I have not planned anything. I packed the boat with spear guns, fishing rods, all the good stuff. And um, yeah, I've just come out here. Gonna grab some oysters first. Completely forgot my oyster knife, so I found this in the boat. That should do the trick. But um, yeah, hopefully these clouds blow over a bit and then we can get into some fishing. Basically explore the whole place until I run out of fuel. That's the plan, so let's do it. Like I said before guys, I've packed no food for the whole day. So whatever I can catch is um, gonna be what I eat. And if I don't catch anything, obviously I'm gonna be pretty hungry. And I've got the squid jig, so I'm pretty keen to try that out. I don't really know how to catch a squid, so we'll give it a go. That guy's a bit small for me to eat, but um, it's a good sign there's life around here. That is the most colourful crab I've ever seen. It's so colourful. Ooh, <laughs> I don't want to get bitten. <laughs> Holy crap guys, I was just walking through and I've spotted a stonefish. They are one of the most deadly just animals in the ocean. <sighs> Let me get a little bit closer. Now I know you're probably thinking, Nick, that just looks like a rock, but that's exactly what they're designed to look like. They're meant to look like a rock. So they are like the most camouflaged they could possibly be. Now this guy, he's not the biggest one I've ever seen, but like, man, I don't wanna get too close to him. Yeah, if I just get the camera, I can show you. <laughs> it's just a rock, guys. <laughs> it's just a stupid rock. Oh, I can't believe you fell for that. No, but for real, guys. Like, just looking along here, there's guaranteed to be heaps of them. I just haven't spotted one. And uh, if I do, I'll show you. But if I step on it first, you'll never see me post ever again. Holy crap. It worked. There we go. Seriously, just drop that. Oh. I used to hate oysters, and I literally love them now. That was the best. Oh. How good was that? The little, little one. You're just as good. These little suckers pack a little punch of protein, so should keep you running for a bit. Give you a bit of energy if you ever like in an actual survival situation. Uh, well, the sun's come out and I've smashed a few of these oysters, so I might head um, head on over to the uh, the fishing spot and see if I can catch some squid or even some brim or something. I'm not worried about catching the biggest, best-looking fish. Just something that's legal that I can um, that I can. Uh, Eat, pretty much. I'm up. So I just pulled up. It's really shallow in here, but there's a giant shipwreck right there. Just completely out of water that I've never seen before because usually the tide is up so much higher. But I'm gonna go check it out. It looks sick. That eagle had a fish. That's insane. They just came out of there. And also, I just spotted this. I think it might be an octopus hole. Oh yeah, it looks pretty scary. I don't know what kind of animal just digs a hole and then decorates the outside. Probably an octopus or something. Oh! Jesus. Oh. Something just bit me so hard.
Wow. That was really fun. I was messing around so much that I completely lost track of time and hunger. But now I'm heading back to the boat. I'm getting really hungry, so got to get back to uh, trying to catch something to eat. Pretty shallow, but we're getting out of here. I think I timed that tide perfectly. See you later, shipwreck. All right, honestly, it's time to get some food now. I'm really hungry. Let's go do some fishing. I've just pulled up to the most beautiful spot. It's really shallow. I think I'm just gonna throw the squid jig and see if I can get anything. It's heaps of seagrass, so it might actually be a good spot. This one will do the trick, look how bright that is. If a squid doesn't hit this, I don't know. Well, a squid didn't hit this, so I moved on to a new spot. And guess what we got? We got squid. <laughs> That's the first squid I've ever caught in my life. He's so small. He's tiny. I'm gonna let him go. I want to get a bigger one than this. I've never caught a squid before though. You ready, buddy? Kidding. That was the sickest. I've never caught a squid in my life. All right, we got to get a big one, and then we can eat. He's about to take it. We got one. Oh, this one's even small. Give me, buddy. It's all right, buddy. He's trying to bite me, this little bugger. So I caught another little tiny one. I'm not going to eat this. It's just too small. So I'll put him back in the water. Um, and hopefully he'll be all right. That's it, mate. These have to be the world's smallest squid. <laughs> ah, I need the big boys see what happens with this little beauty. If it's just the little ones, I'll keep catching them for fun, but um, yeah, I'm starting to get really hungry. I didn't catch any bigger squid, so I really gently released this little guy back to his home. Uh. Damn it. Bastard bit me. Look at all that ink. Wow, he's just turned black. Alright guys, so the squid are off the bite and um, I think I'm going to go for a spear around here and try and get a fish so that's going to be my last resort. If I don't get a fish, I think I'm going to be going hungry.
All right, new plan. Um, I just cannot see out of these goggles. They keep fogging up real bad. So I've changed goggles and I just realized I left the tip on. So lucky I didn't actually go for a big fish. All right, now the tip's off. Um, and I've got a good snorkel. I won't be able to film it, I can't. Um, but if I get a fish, we'll have something to cook up. If not, I'll be back. So wish me luck. <laughs> One eternity later. You're kidding me. Look at that. <laughs> Another mullet. Oh, that's hilarious. There was a huge school going past. And this was, uh, this one was gone by. Just got them in the tail again. They're so quick. It's even bigger than the last. And I'm that hungry, so this is going to go well. Here's my view. Here's my kitchen. And here's the nice mullet I got. It's massive. Alright, let's fill this thing up. I'm gonna check to see if it's got row first. I bet it is. I bet it's a big female. <gasps> There's the row. Holy! That's the stuff. Oh my god. Look how much there is. See, this is what I was talking about in the last video with the male and the female, but they are fucking massive. Wow, so. We got two delicious fillets right here and that damn row. Perfect. And I've got my egg, my flour, and my breadcrumbs. I gotta uh, mix this up though. Do this fillet first, so bam, flour first. And then we'll go egg. And now breadcrumbs. Yes. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that oil's definitely ready. Oh damn it, that burnt the shit out of me. Mm. Oh, that hurts so much. This looks pretty good too. <laughs> oh, that's ridiculous. I'm not super sure how you're meant to prepare row, but I'm gonna let it have a little bit more. Yeah, but the fillets, they look done. They look delicious. Mmm. Wait, fuck off, mate. All right, it's all done. Here it is. There we go. Lunch on the beach. That is just like a giant sack of eggs. For the people that are going to be concerned about this, there's a million mullet in the ocean and I shot one of about like 50 that flew past. So these guys aren't going uh, extinct or anything. And I didn't know, sometimes you just don't know. But since I got it, I'm not going to waste it. I'm going to eat all this. And it's really nice. Well, you probably couldn't see that, but the pelican that was just flying off, uh, it just took the carcass of the mullet, which I was going to save for bait because I have another carcass, but nah, pelican stole it and it's eating it over there right now, so. All right guys, usually I finish my videos with like a super sick uh, drone shot or something, but this island has heaps of bird life. They're all chilling right there now, so I'm not gonna get the drone up because that'll probably just disturb them. Um, I'm gonna head off now. So thanks for watching. If you didn't know, I'm going full-time YouTube. So uh, if you haven't subscribed, make sure to do so because I'll be pumping heaps of vids like this out. And for the rest of you, I'll see you guys next time. Catch ya.